This is Ryan Rieger, and you're watching Eerie Extreme. All right, so we totally torched last night. We're going to Lake Pleasant, a little closer today, smaller lake. But today is the last nice day before the weather drops out. It's supposed to get super windy. Going to get revenge on them today at Lake Pleasant. That's what's coming up on Eerie Extreme. Uh. I'm Dave, and for the past 20 years, I've traveled the country fishing bass tournaments for a living, and nothing else compares to the spot where I was blessed to be born and raised. So I've gathered up a few old friends. Oh yeah. <laughs> and we're having an absolute blast as we rediscover my old stomping grounds. Doing things we've never done before. Going places we've never gone before. Yeah, baby! Basically, just goofing off in this awesome place we call home. This is Eerie. Eerie Extreme. Hello. Hello there. How you doing? Good, how are you? Hey. So do you guys know each other? I've been looking forward to this one for a long time. I got a big group of guys together and we're heading to Chautauqua Lake. <laughs> but before we hit the ice, we got a lot of rigging to do. I'm here for sport. <laughs> this is how we were all Alright. Yeah! <laughs> I'm Jacob Sonic with Angler, working with the company that Dave works for. <laughs> Dave just got fired from our company. Today's target is walleye. Jake is here because we're gonna do something a little creative with the Angler Bullseye. So those are emeralds? I mean, I didn't know they got that big. We got Kirk from the East End Angler, who brought the minnows, of course. We have not one, but two Mark Grazianos. And of course, the consummate complainer, Uncle Skip Dog. You could have brushed the snow off the car. Breaker 1-9, this is Hurricane Dave, out. Breaker, breaker 1-3, over. Hey, bud. Yes, Hurricane Dave right here, driving down to 86, heading down to Chautauqua, over now. <laughs> First of all, watch the road, turn the thing off. Breaker 1-9, heading out, over and out, peace. <laughs> We're here. We're excited. How you doing there, bud? We're gonna go do some fuzzy grubs and leech and we're gonna try back trolling on the brake lines. We got Erie News Now is here to watch. We got the Discovery Channel over here. We got Outdoor Channel. They're all here, ESPN. Say hi. That's NBC over there, Tom Brochaw. So we're gonna track our trip today like we do all the time. But this time we're gonna assign holes and then we'll mark each individual set of holes is going to be like a tournament so that when I win, we'll know that it was legit. <laughs> Using the bullseye. We have no idea what we're doing, but that's how we were all. Season four is no different. We never get smarter. Spin the camera around. Show everybody how dumb you look. It might look dumb, but I'm not. You have got a lot dumber. On bases right here. We got everything finally. We've been screwing around for an hour and a half. Now we're gonna, <laughs> hour and a half, that's funny. I mean, four hours, and I'm going in the hut with Skippy. It's eight o'clock at night. We have not even seen a fish at all. I can't even express my disappointment so far. The word on the street was they were biting. We're here at prime time. Is one big walleye too much to ask? Sucker came over and got it. It's a big one, dude. Here it is. It's about time. Oh, he might got me tangled in something. No, it's just a big giant fish. What? Oh, I hope he didn't get me stuck. I think it might it's... be. I think you're on the bottom of the ice. <laughs> I had a bite. No, don't don't mess with it. I'm not in the bottom of the ice. I got a big fish. Look, see it moving? Yeah. Yeah. You have a log. I might, but I had a bite. No, it's a fish. It's a musky or something. It's a big giant fish. No way. What is that? I think it's fishing line. Yeah, or some kind of. It's, yeah, it's either a springy log. Or... Hey. Hey. Keep pulling it. It's bigger. Look at this. <laughs> it's a oh my goodness. What do you think? Nice. You count it. Is this a show? <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh Let's say we wrap nice. it there. Let's uh, weigh it. <laughs> weigh it. What? I knew it was a stick. So that was that. 12 hours, one stick.
So we totally torched last night. It really makes me mad when we don't do good, especially when we had so many people. I mean, we had eight people. Well, we covered miles. I mean, I walked a lot and we drilled a million holes. Very disturbing. Anyway, I'm going to get revenge on them today at Lake Pleasant. Yo. Hey. Yeah. We're going to Pleasant. Okay. All right. Bye. Bye. Wait, 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 you said Finley, right? Not Pleasant? <laughs> no, I said Pleasant. You did say Pleasant, okay. Cool. All right, I'll see you in a little bit. Okay, we are here. Well, there's a couple guys out here. We heard it when this ice wasn't safe, but it looks like we're gonna be okay. Cold water kills. Uh, this is better for these warmer, you know, 25 to 35, 40 degree days. It's called a trekker suit. I used to take chances on the ice, but not anymore. Striker ice float suits have changed my life. And for anyone who ventures out on the ice, I highly recommend the investment. Here on Lake Pleasant, it's been a while since we've been here, but I grew up fishing here. It's no electric motors, no motors at all. It's you got a paddle, and I got a good workout when I was younger. They stock this lake with trout. I've been fishing here since I was a little kid. My dad used to bring me out. So anyway, it's kind of like a little small trophy lake that we have right in our backyard. So we're gonna drill a million holes. We started out in the basin, out in that 40 foot range, couldn't catch anything. So we're moved, we moved in shallow, and we're just gonna set up in this area. We got a lithium auger. We could probably drill 200 holes with that. While he's doing that, um, and get some baits rigged up. I'm just gonna sit here for a minute and just fish since there's nothing going on. Okay. I checked every single hole. There is nothing. I don't know if that's a fish or not. We better catch something because I can't take another day like yesterday. Let me know if you see any. All right. Got him. <laughs> Perch. <laughs> that's not what we want. It's a fish. Geez, how long did we fish yesterday? <laughs> the reason we come to Lake Pleasant is to catch big fish. That one was small, but at least it's a sign. And drop down there again. There are huge pike, bluegills, crappies, perch, trout. They're all here. It's just a matter of time. Ooh. They're getting bigger, and oh look, here comes Uncle Skippy Underpants to the party. Okay, Uncle T's been doing this for a long time. And frankly, he doesn't deserve to catch a fish, but we're gonna let him catch one anyway. We're gonna catch big ones? Yes, we're gonna catch a big ones. Let's see what happens. Skippy's gonna catch one. Go right above where those fish are. Go down a little, no, stop. Don't quit walking away. Now jig it. You can't screw this up, because they'll leave. There he goes. Now stop, stop, stop. So you can feel him bite it. Keep it right there. See him down there? He's gonna come up and get it. The one below the- Yeah, see the red mark? Yes. See him coming? Get ready. Now don't jiggle it too much. Get ready. Go, go, go. You got him? Ooh, that seems like a nice one. Oh, yeah. What That's is it? small, isn't it? Yeah, it's small. What is it? It's a bluegill, isn't it? No. Is it crappy? No. I have no idea then. Pumpkin seed. Oh, yeah. The, oh, that's right. Say hi. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get you back in the water. Oh, there you go. So we let him catch one. You're done for the year. Thanks. Get the camera out. Okay, so I gotta admit, that was kind of cool seeing the Skipmeister Jack one. So I shall dance in celebration. Sorry, back to business. Got him. Holy crap. That little rod makes it fun. <laughs> oh, look at that. Yeah, buddy. That's a big one. Oh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> I might have a big one. I just caught a big one. Feels like another one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> look at that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, those are nice ones. Look at that. Big gill. Look at that size of my hand. Oh. 
there. You're not seeing them now? Got them. Terry, I got another one. It's a big one. Oh my gosh, it's a giant. Dude, here's one. Oh yeah. That's a bull. Holy crap. Look at that. For the Northland country, that is a trophy. Please support our Erie Extreme partners. Marquette Savings Bank. We create website design and marketing. The Avonia Tavern. Fishing Online. Bentley Tree Care. East End Angler. Palmero Toyota. The Pennsylvania Fish and Boat Commission. Driscoll Tax and Accounting. RW Petruso Hearing and Audiology. And Visit Erie. It's a beautiful day. This episode is sponsored in part by Someday I'll Tackle. What's under your bobber? You got one? Yeah. Check this out. This is crazy. Yeah. Uh-oh, uh-oh, double. Oh my gosh! Look at this, baby. That's a big one. Aaron's got a big one, too. Don't break them off. Take your time. You got them? Yeah. I don't think it's that big. Sad yeah, it is. <laughs> what? Wait, stop, stop. Oh my gosh, it is. It is, it's Aaron's fish. Huh? <laughs> he, was, he had my hook also. What? I he had both hooked. hooks, mine came out. He ate he... Aaron's fish. So wait a minute, we gotta document this. this. What? I pulled him out of the hole, and he had Aaron's hook in him too. That's Aaron's hook? Yes, and this is mine that I pulled him out of the hole. This with. is Aaron's hook? Yes. That's a giant. Dude, I pulled him out of the hole, so it, it, this is crazy. Seriously? Whose fish. fish is it then? Here, Aaron. Aaron. Did you ever see anything like that before? I don't think so. Ever catch one that big? No, I don't think. That's wild. Have you ever seen that? I have, but I'm a pro. <laughs> a pro what? <laughs> you want to know what the best thing about this is? Huh? See this hat right here? There's one thing I don't like about it. The ball on the top? Yeah. I was going to cut it off, right? And you then I that. thought, well, maybe it'll shrivel apart or something. Check this out. <laughs> it's a detachable cat toy. Look at it. It comes off. It's got a snap on it. They don't even tell you stuff like that. What do you think about that? Uh-oh. 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 Oh, gosh. Got him. Cat toys. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Terry, I got another one, bud. <laughs> uh oh there's a school here this. oh man look at this one. <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> look at that dude look at how big this thing is there's one aaron's got one too look at that see if see if you got another big one see this is why we come here is it a big one <laughs> here he comes you're gonna catch one you're gonna get a double yeah, I got coming. mine for sure. Got him. Got him? Didn't need it yet. <laughs> Another pumpkin seed. Got to get back down we'll there real that. quick. They come through in like little schools. Did you notice that? There's like, like a desert wasteland down there and then all of a sudden they just show up. Got him. That's a big one. Oh yeah. I'll pull this out. You don't want to get them tangled in that cord. Yeah, it's a pretty good one. I mean, most people would keep that, but not, not a giant. See that belly on him? Yep. That's thick, man. Yeah. Aaron's got one. <laughs> you seriously got maggots in your pocket? Yeah, because you broke the lid Don't. and put it in my pocket. Terry's having a problem today. <laughs> yeah, I'm with you. That's my problem. Those are wax worms. <laughs> Thanks, Terry. Why are they in your pocket? <laughs> You grabbed them, threw them down on the ground, broke the lid. So I you put them up, in the pocket. Put it back in my pocket. Okay. Are we done yet? Are we no. done yet? No, we're not done yet. Well, Terry was right for once. We're not done yet. We're actually just getting started. There that he is. One? Yeah, I got him. Make sure you get your thing out of the. They're here. Oh yeah. Oh dude. Is it a big one? Yeah, yeah. it's a nice one. There's more down there. Look at that. Nice one. We're putting a nice pile of fish together now. We got this set at about 13 feet. See the gears turning? 
Yeah, you gotta spin it until we see your bait, but your bait might not be at the right depth. All right, so we're setting up the Markham camera so we can take a look at what's actually going on underwater. Okay, we just had a big fish swim through. And the water's clear, so this is gonna be cool. Got him. Oh, dude. Did you see that? I don't wanna, I don't wanna lose this fish because it's a big one. Wow, so cool. Dude, I, I don't wanna lose him. He's over there. What is it, a big one? Big perch. Grab him. <laughs> oh my gosh. I filmed him swim through on the camera. I'm jigging your jig with my hand and he bit it. How big is that? That was unbelievable. Look at that thing. Wow. Dude, look at the size of that. That's a big one, dude. That is big. That's like 13. Yeah. VMC tungsten tubby jig right there. Look at that. Slab. That's a slaunch, a Lake Pleasant Donkey Kong. Look at that, slaunches. So this is what we're fishing for, donkeys. Hmm, apparently Uncle Skippy was pretty mad about the maggot ordeal. He left, he literally went home. <laughs> oh well, we can handle this, right? <laughs> Hey, right here. Don't forget you're filming. You forgot, right? What do you mean? You were just filming the ground and the sky and the trees. <laughs> yeah, I know. Skippy left. Terry Dunn left the building. He left us. My pants got pulled down. What? <laughs> My jig got yeah. pushed back. <laughs> oh yeah, bud. Oh yeah. Oh, it's getting freezing out here now. Yeah, it, it got cold. Wind's really starting to pick up. Our holes are freezing up out here. Like if we only had this set up as soon as we started. <laughs> How are we looking out there? Good? I think we'll be good, yeah. It feels good in there. Dave, they're here. Nuh uh. How many? A bunch? Yeah, a crap ton. It's starting to snow and blow and get cold, so we decided to set the camera up inside the hut. Oh, look at him. He's not eating it. <laughs> Ah, you suck. I would have caught that one. Oh my gosh. How come you didn't catch him? Did you see him nibbling on it? Yeah, he didn't have the hooks. He I was a little guy. I didn't even set the hook. Did you did you feel him bite it? Mm-mm. I was just watching the screen. I didn't even I didn't even feel him bite it. Is there fish on there? Is there hey fish, fish. Dude. Where? There's fish on the screen. You pulled it away from him. Drop it down. Oh gosh, look at them all down there. So many. Oh come on. You gotta go up. Go up. Come on, buddy. Those are big ones. That's a bluegill. Big one. He turned looking at it. Oh, oh. oh my. Oh. Come on, man. I think you got to jiggle it or do something. Let's switch. Here, just leave yours there. See if I can, because I got the magic jig on. Did you get oh, there's, a, there's another one. There's another one. See him? Oh, yeah, there he is. Oh, <laughs> I got him. <laughs> that was crazy. <laughs> That's the little guy we saw on the camera. I can't explain how fun the camera is to use on the ice, but it's become obvious that we have to move around in order to keep catching the big ones. There he comes. They're perch. Got him. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. Oh, it feels pretty big, actually. Oh, yeah. That was cool. <laughs> He's a fatty. Dude, I'll take perch like that all day long. They fight hard. Those are big, too. Holy cow. Big and 12 inchers. There's another one down there. Here he comes. Come on, fish. Oh, oh got him. Oh, he's wrapped around the cable. Oh, come on. Big one, big one. Yeah. Look at that. He wrapped himself around the cable like five times. Oh, they're right. They're in here, Dave. Are they really? Yeah, they're not on camera, but they're on their flasher. Doing something. They want something different than they did earlier. Oh, here comes one. The one below, it's going to come up. There he comes. There it is. It's loaded right here. Come on. I can't see anything on the camera. He bent my rod down. Those are gills. 
Yep. Got him. A little gills. There's a bunch of them here, though. Here comes another one. From below, he's coming. No, another small one. As it got darker, we started to see these little tiny shrimp-like things on the camera. I have no idea what they are. Look, there's another shrimp, see it? Right there? What? There, see it move? Yeah. You videoing that? Mm -hmm. Weird. This is it, dude. This is it, this is it. Here he comes, see him? It's a perch. Oh, <laughs> oh my God, oh my God. You see them biting? Yep. Yeah, that perch, they come out of nowhere and eat it. It's They're really active. <gasps> Big blue. Oh, gosh. Oh, boy. Is that a crappier blue? It's a blue. Come on. Oh. Come on. Oh. Eat it. Oh. oh, that was so awesome. This is the biggest one of the day. Yeah. That was cool. Here we are. <laughs> this is the camera. Here's Aaron. Well, what an awesome revenge ice fishing day that was. We caught a ton of fish and some real trophies too. The only bad part is that everyone that was with us yesterday couldn't have came along today to experience it. We got to see some amazing stuff on the Markham camera. Uncle Skip Dog got to catch his fish of the year and it looks like we might make it home before midnight tonight. Cool. So we'll see you next week.